The third row seat trades off space for ruggedness, but the Lexus LX interior is lushly appointed somewhat compromised for interior space by its truck-based frame. The Lexus LX still has a vast cabin with lots of seats and lovely fit and finish it earns an almost perfect score for comfort and quality, let down only by a small third row seat the LX no longer dupes the interior of the related Toyota Land Cruiser, which means all the former utilitarian bits have been scrubbed inside. The LX more closely resembles a Lexus sedan, with beautiful stretches of leather and open poor wood. If you like switches and knobs and buttons, you're in luck here the LX has myriad controls for its off-road and luxury features, but most of them are of the set and forget strain driver and front passenger get leather covered, generously sized chairs that feel supportive and soft to the touch climbing in the LX is another matter, it's built to ride over big obstacles, so the climb into the cockpit takes a tall step. Even though the LX has an air suspension that lowers by about 2 inches for easier access, In the second row, passengers get less sculpted seats, but aren't hindered by the front seats the driver seat moves out of the way under its own power, and the second row seat slides on a 3.5-inch track to flex between passenger and cargo space the seat backs also split on 40-20-40 lines, for bigger cargo loads the third row seat folds out of the way with power assist, and they'll spend lots of time that way even for small people, it's a cramped place to be. The fold-away mechanism flips up the third row seats and rotates them to the sides of the vehicle, which helps mitigate the effect of the LX's high cargo floor. The seats can't be removed, though, so the cargo hold is narrower than in other luxury SUVs. The split rear tailgate features a power upper door, while the bottom section raises and lowers with minimal effort. 